Hi everyone, today I am going to tell you a short story and this one is my original story. I wrote it. So let me begin. And the name of the story is Listen to the Echo. So let me begin. Every day morning I do my uh, morning prayer. Actually morning in the sense very early morning means it was blue hour. I used to go to the terrace and do my morning prayer. Once while I was uh, just uh, doing yogas and some other silent prayer, I heard the a beautiful tabla music. And believe me or not, that tabla music was coming daily and exactly at that time, it was blue hour means the sun was uh, significantly uh, below the horizon. So very calm and quiet atmosphere, even uh, I felt as if the, the birds also, they were enjoying that tabla music. So I also enjoyed that tabla music every day. And gradually, um, I was very much interested who the person was because it went on for three years. So I was very much uh, anxious to know that music was coming just uh, from a nearby heart uh, on the bank of the river because my house was also on the bank of the near the bank of the river. So one day I decided and I went there. It was a walking distance. When I went there, I saw, uh, I had already seen there a beautiful small temple of Lord Shiva and Parvati. And that temple side only, uh, this small hut, the man was practicing his tabla. Every day I heard, but I never uh, thought of going there. But one day I couldn't resist and I went there to see who the person was. When I uh, reached there, I saw that the door was locked. So I came back and again next day I heard the same sound. And it, it was beautiful, an amazing sound. Only one expert can do that. Then one day I thought that maybe I am late because of which I am missing the person. So I have to go a little bit early. I decided and the next day I went a little early than before, than my usual time. And I saw the music was going on. So. I didn't like to disturb and I stood outside waiting for the man. After a while, the music was stopped and he came out. Uh, I just cleared my throat just to draw his attention. And he looked at me and said, yes, how can I help you? I said, no sir, uh, no help. I am just uh, very eager to know um, how many years you have practiced this tabla music and your music is very beautiful and uh, it is really perfect. Then the man said in the same, he had no change in his uh, face, means facial expression. He said in, <clears throat> in a deep voice, yes, I was practicing it for, uh, for three years. Then I said, sir, uh, if you don't mind, can I ask you a question? Then he said, yes, ask me. I said, sir, you are playing the tabla so nicely. If you play it in some uh, metro cities, you can earn a lot of money and name and fame and everything. Why don't you go to any metro city? Then the man in a half-smiled way, he said, Look, I am not 
doing this practice or I am not playing this tabla music for anyone and I am just uh, playing the tabla for my self-satisfaction and to satisfy my Lord, Lord Shiva and Parvati. And by the way, I don't want neither money nor name nor fame. So I don't want to go any metro city. And ma'am, money is not everything. I did it for myself only. But somehow, I mean, anyways, thank you so much for your suggestion. He told me and he went away. And believe me or not, I was stunned with his reply. He even didn't wait what reply or what I will say. He went away. Then I stood like a statue there. I stood still. And a little later I thought, I don't know what type of philosophy this person has. But there is no doubt that he is an expert in tabla. And also his words, the last word he said, told me that money is not everything, he poured in my ear. And I was thinking, thinking only whether his answer is uh, uh, right or wrong. Because in this present world, who doesn't want money? But look at this person, he flatly refused to gain any money or name or fame while the people are dying for it. I really praised that person's mentality, philosophy. But still then, if you think about the uh, reality, then everybody does want money. Somehow, I came back and I thought, yes, this world is a uh, place of um, I mean, varieties of people and varieties of mentalities. Anyways, this is my story only. But the music I heard, that was true. Although I never met that person. Thank you so much. I just heard the music and I made a story. Well, if you have time, please visit my site, thegalpa.com. Thank you.